What's up TME gang? I'm Amy and I'm back with the greatest video you will ever watch ever. If you want to talk about some like really weird shoes with me, some new shoe trends, a little bit of niche shoe content, free foot sightings. No, I'm just kidding. That's what we're going to do today. It's going to be wild. It's going to be great. I keep telling myself I have worn flip-flops so these should be no different. And if you're confused about what the heck I'm talking about, we're talking about mesh shoes. Been on the runways and in the high-end designer space for a few years now. It has finally trickled down to the commonplace store and I scooped up a couple pairs from Anthropology that we're gonna try today. I love a ballet flat and this is just basically a see-through version. So this could be super cool and amazing, could be a disaster. And we're gonna go on the journey together. First off, we're going Jeffrey Campbell. These are his Swan Lake flats. Now, if you've seen any of my content here at the Mom Edit, these might look familiar to you because they are a version of my all-time favorite shoe, and that's Jeffrey Campbell's Dancerina flat. So this is the mesh version. It is genuinely the reason that I was like, all right, I wanna try this trend out. You don't even actually need your hands, at least I don't, to wear these shoes. This is just like the most magical little band. You can slip your foot right into it without needing to use your hands. So it's really good when you're on the go, when you're a busy mom, you gotta run out the door. These are amazing. It's stiff, but it has a slight bend to it. The bottom is very minimal, like a classic ballet flat. And I love that this taupe color could really just go with anything. Now, if you look up these shoes, they come in some epically wild colors. We're talking lavender, hot pinks, baby blues. The baby blues were very tempting, but I do like that I feel like you could just throw this on with any outfit and it would give a very chic, classic upgraded look to your natural belly flat. The second pair I'm trying is actually by Anthropology themselves. These are the By Anthropology Mesh Ballet Flat. They named them very practically. And I was obsessed with this little white color with the white trim. When I've seen these flats around on Pinterest or social media, I've been seeing a very bright white color like this. And I think it looks unbelievably chic with the outfits that they are styled with. I love how minimal they are. There's no band over it, so it's very sleek. This one is actually pretty soft, bouncier flat compared to the bottom of the Jeffy Campbell one. This one also has just like a little bit more of a cushion. So all around, this is the most comfortable, I think, of the bunch, simply just because of this sole. The sole is really good quality. Last but not least, you're gonna have to excuse me because these are not mesh. However, I do feel like they go right along in the exact same trend of this little see-through toe peeping <laughs> trend. And this is a netted flat. These are actually an alternative to a high-end designer brand. This netted is actually very popular on the high-end fashion runways right now. So I did want to try it purely for that reason. And this is just another one from Jeffrey Campbell. This one's cute. It comes with a little extra hardware with the buckle. Um, even though it does have a buckle and a little bit of like a faux leather plasticky strap. I will say that out of the three, this one felt like it maybe ran the most snug. There's no stretch to this, there's no give. So if you have a wider foot or a longer foot and sometimes you need extra room, you could consider sizing up a half size, especially because your toes are gonna show through. It has a very similar sole to the other Jeffrey Campbell. It's a little bit more stiff, very minimal, very chic, slim lined. Obviously these are the most unique of the bunch, but the most fun and unique and different to style up with outfits. If you're someone like me who loves making a little bit more of like a funky fun fashion statement with your outfits i would look into these and like i said just watch the sizing consider going up a half size to give your foot some room okay you guys that was a journey overall a little bit surprised by how the whole try on went and how the shoes felt I think if I had to choose a favorite, it is the pair that I'm still currently wearing. It's the one by Anthropology. I just love the way that the white looked on. This is honestly what I went in hoping for to be cute with outfits I had envisioned, and they did come out feeling like the best. I love how they went on. If anything, you might even be able to size down a half size in these. These, the whole reason I started this try on, were actually quite amazing as well. Um, they weren't as easy to slip on as the Dance Arena flat by Jeffrey Campbell, but these were very comfortable. I loved the darker look, maybe because they hid the look of my toes a little bit more. All three of these were wildly different, so much different than any shoe that I've ever had, even though they look just like a typical ballet flat. But there's something about the whole see-through thing that really makes them funky and fun. So these are good. Last but not least, I'm bummed by these, honestly. I actually had a lot higher expectations for these. I thought they'd be a little bit more chic on. And honestly, all I could think when I had them on was they looked like pool shoes 
or like scuba diving shoes. It felt like you could just like see my toes in an awkward way. And they also were not comfortable. There's like a shiny backing on it and that rubbed on my foot. Even in just a few seconds of having them on, it was immediate like, oh yeah, this is not gonna work. The Chic Design Alternative Dupe knockoff is a no for me. But I wanna hear from you. What did you think of these shoes? Do you like them? Do you already own a pair? How are you styling them? Let me know in the comments. And if there's any other fun, funky shoes you're curious about, you want me to try? or any piece of clothing in general, let me know because I'm your girl. I'm willing to go down this road. If you like this video, please like the video and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Love you guys and we'll see you again soon. Bye.